the four singers that make up the highwaymen were the same four out of the five that were there at the beginning. Steve Butts, Steve Trott, Bob Burnett, and myself. Uh, Chan Daniels, the fifth guy, passed away in 1975 from a lung infection. But the, but the singers in the high man, and we have a bass player, a fifth man, Johan Helton. But the singers have been together for the whole 50 years. We do about 15 to 20 concerts a year. I mean, we really will go anywhere to work. We just love, we're best friends and we love playing together. The audiences are definitely old. <laughs> They're definitely our age. Um, which is fine. They're very appreciative. We do a lot of new material and they seem to like it. We will always do, I would say, a third of our material will be the, the old material, certainly all the hits. But and also we take some of the old stuff and redo it and make it new. But we also like learning new songs. We just did a whole album of Irish songs. And the only one on there that uh, we used to do is Gypsy Rover. I got a phone call from Warner Brothers Music about three years ago. So I'd say in 05, 06, no, maybe 06. Asking about the publishing for Santiano, which was on the flip side of Michael. And uh, turns out, this is a, my arrangement, that it was recorded in France and became the biggest hit in France. Number one, and it's been a hit six times, and it's on about 25 albums in French. I didn't even know about it. But uh, fortunately, Warner Brothers did know about it, and once they knew where I was, I got paid. The original version was exactly like the Highwayman's version of Santiano, note for note. 